most visitors to Wolfsburg, Germany, will see the fantastic car museum at the Altestadt, but relatively few will take the two-minute drive to one of the country's hidden gems, the Volkswagen Auto Museum. Here are some of the cooler vehicles you'll find there. 1943 Volkswagen Briesel Käfer No surprise that the museum has a decent-sized collection of Beetles, which are known as Käfers in Germany. This 1943 Briesel Käfer, pretzel beetle, nicknamed for the shape of its split rear window, is the oldest in the museum and a rare example of a wartime era KDF wagon. 1949 Volkswagen K for Cabrio This car meant built 1949 Cabriolet is an early example of the drop-top Volkswagen Beetle. Along with a handful of convertibles, the Auto Museum has several beautiful examples of coach-built cars based on the Beetle platform. 1978 Volkswagen Type 1, the last German-built Beetle. This was the very last Volkswagen Beetle to be built in Germany, rolling off the assembly line on January 19th. 1978, the Auto Museum is also home to the 20 millionth Volkswagen Beetle, a limited edition 1981 Silver Bug built in Mexico. 1965 Volkswagen Type 147, the Type 147 Klee for Wagen, small van, was commissioned by the German Postal Service, though the Swiss Post Office bought some as well. The 147 used a wider platform of the Type 14, Carmen Gaia with the powertrain from the Beetle. Other parts were sourced from the Type 2 Transporter and Type 3 Fastback. Volkswagen built 6,139 examples between 1964 and 1972. Though they were prone to rust, the Auto Museum's example is in perfect shape. 1963 Volkswagen EA128 Prototype The Auto Museum is home to several VW prototypes, most labeled EA for and twin clungs off track which means development contract. The 1963 EA 128 was Volkswagen's vision for a large luxury car. Its three-place front bench allows it to seat six, albeit somewhat intimately. 1955 Volkswagen EA 4712 Throughout the 1950s, Volkswagen was looking to move away from the Beetle. The EA 4712 was the 12th of 15 prototypes produced by Turin coach Bill Gaia. This prototype featured a transverse link front axle, torsion bar rear suspension, and a fully synchronized transmission. The Auto Museum has EA4712 displayed with its collection of Carmen Gaius, which would adopt many of the prototype's design cues. 1961 Volkswagen 1500 Cabriolet Prototype Volkswagen produced 16 hand-built prototypes of a Type 3 Cabriolet, and the Auto Museum has one of the two survivors. The car was unveiled at the 1961 Frankfurt Auto Show but was never put into production. The folding convertible top featured a glass rear window. 1949 Volkswagen T1 Prototype Perhaps the most famous prototype in the Auto Museum is the T1. Prototype for the Type 2 Transporter. Dutch Volkswagen importer Bang Pon is credited with the idea for, and first sketch of, a Volkswagen-based van. And this is the prototype that was revealed to the press on November 11, 1949. 1978 Volkswagen Transporter Synchro Prototype. Volkswagen's four-wheel drive van Agen Synchro is legendary for both its obscurity and its incredible off-road ability. Five prototypes were built from second-generation transporters in 1978. And this is the only survivor, and if that wasn't enough, it's also a Westphalia camper. Volkswagen would not put the four-wheel drive transporter into production until the all-new T3 model arrived in 1979.